Morning guys. Releasing video today. This is for my unusual name, Italian saw, the Tondu, the Tondu 45. And if any of you try to find the, any info on the Tondu, it'll be very, very difficult because they're, they're a real rarity. I mean, incredibly rare. And, but when you have a close look at it, if you kind of look at any Italian saws, you'll think, hang on, that looks remarkably similar to the, of course, the Alpina, the professional 45 Alpina. So it's a, <clears throat> as far as I can tell, it's identical. The casings, the top cover, the air filter, the pull start housing, the kill switch, chain brake. So I believe it's just a rebadged Alpina. And so I bought this saw as a non-runner and fitted with a 15 inch roller nose bar, which looks in good shape. It has the felling spike. As far as I can tell, absolutely complete, but just a complete non-runner. And had, um, or has really, really, really good compression. So it's just been hanging in my collection next to my Alpina professional 55 my 70 90 and now they're nearly all sold this one's now going up for sale so I took off the side cover check for the spark no spark I put a replacement plug in it sparks and So, it fires and it runs erratic, so it obviously is not right. And as I say, I bought it as a non-runner, and but it does fire. And I've done nothing else to it. In fact, I didn't, um, until I'd just bothered checking it again the other day after several people had messaged, I haven't done anything with it. It was just literally filling a gap until I'd found an Alpina badged an Alpina badged 45 um, but she's beautifully made all magnesium alloy chain brake working and obviously pull start housing yes all good no brakes anywhere around the chassis as far as I can tell air filters present turn her over So just a very, very clean saw. And so the person I bought it from knew their saws. And so, so I'm being very careful to say, I bought this saw as a non-runner and it's just been on display and it's being sold as a non-runner. Um, so hopefully it might be a great restoration project for somebody to work through and find out what are the issues the saw may have but as far as I can tell, she's absolutely complete. And I will quickly do a restart. And in fact, if I pause the video very quickly, I'll pull the side cover off and show just how clean she is on the underside. I'll pause it and grab the spanner and I'll be back in a moment. Hi guys, I'm back. I've just undone the side cover. It really is just worth, worth seeing how clean she is inside because if you, have one of these and you want one for parts then it's great to know chain brake strap in great condition no brakes obviously clutch all present little serial number badge exhaust looks in great shape it's just a lovely clean saw and if i undo the top then quickly which i should have done a second ago again harder than it looks one-handed Okay, one second guys, let me just try and get this um, cover off and I will unpause the video. Hi guys, back again. So, the mesh air filter, 
is complete and looks in good condition and the top cover as well all good okay I shall put the video back on the stand and screw it back together come back attempt to restart and hopefully a suitable for one of you guys out there back in a moment hi again guys okay she's back together and they really are beautifully made saw so I guess if you have an Alpina 45 and you're looking for spares then this might be an amazing donor saw or unless you want to go through it and find out um, why it was sold as a, as a non-runner um, the person I bought it from was competent and so um, I presume there's a reason why it's been sold <laughs> Okay, there she is. That's the Tondu 45 going up on eBay for parts or spares only. Thanks for watching, guys. Any questions, please just ask. Bye for now.